Hey guys, sorry about the late start on this one. Have not been feeling 100% today after I ate lunch, so... Got a little bit of an upset stomach, but nothing too bad. So I figured we'd kick off a stream tonight. Let's kick it off first off by saying, Immortal Seeker, thank you for subscribing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. And secondly, I am joined by Mega G Wolf. Hello. And we're just gonna do a, you know, a little quiet fortune cookie for tonight. Gonna kick it off with Donkey Kong Country because it was next to my Super Nintendo. So. <laughs> Seems legit. <laughs> Might as well, right? I don't know which file I want to delete. Convenient game choice. I know. Well, like, sitting right next to my Super Nintendo right now is Yoshi's Island, for obvious reasons. Uh, Super Ghouls and Ghosts from last stream. Sonic Blast Man 2 from, like, two streams before that. Clock Tower. Uh, Earthbound Zero and Bomberman 2, both for NES. Hmm. Good collection. Someone asked if I had a bad egg. It was not an egg. I had a sandwich. It was apparently not too good. Or my stomach is just angry at me. Girl. Both of which I would believe. It's been a stressful couple days, let's just say that. Yeah. But we are we're back on track with things. We're here to play a video game. What you play video games on Twitch? Get out. No, I, it's actually Justin TV. We're actually going to be playing uh, Google. G Google. <laughs> We're just going to be playing Google today. Fair enough. Oh, I can't reach that. Sweet. I was like, type in your username, click on images, and see what you get. But then I realized what you'd get. You just get eighteen-year-old John. Dude, we we would just play like the Hedgehog game. Is what we do. Like you know the oh. you know the hedgehog game, right? Yes. My guy looks like kind of like a silver ripoff. And Dude. I don't know how to feel about that. <laughs> I'd be psyched if I were you. Unless uh, it's like then... paired up with like it's no use over yeah, I was and over again. Say, like I tried to get excited, but in the end it was no use. So Ooh. I'm gonna say. I'm gonna fail this on purpose. Did I oh I almost did it for real without trying. <laughs> Could you have Lukajin in one of your streams soon? She was on the last stream. Like it's all that Luca they want. It was in most of the muted part, sadly, but she was there. Oh man, maybe I should actually wait. What's going on about a new, new rule? New rule? It says mods. Maybe you should explain some new rule stuff to the people just getting here. I'm not even aware what they're talking about. <laughs> this is news to me. I did. Apparently, I'm out of the loop on my own channel. Go figure. Oops, messed that up. God, I can't even think of the last time I played this. Like, last time I played this, I know it was on a stream, but I don't remember when that stream was. Does anyone remember last time we played Donkey Kong Country? I know it was quite a while ago. I don't remember. It could have been one of the times I didn't show up. It's possible. I mean, I show up to all of your streams, John. <laughs> and disconnect <laughs> call. <laughs> ah, crap. I already skipped a couple... I guess we're going through this one, missing most of the secrets. Because I've already missed the early one. Oh, maybe we'll just jam through this instead. I don't you. know if it's because I grew up as a Sega kid or not, but I could never get into these games. I don't know why. You know what? The first one I can understand you not getting into. The, the second one, like, I feel bad about because the second one is a legitimately good game. Hmm. Maybe we should go back and try them out. Because I really like um, Tropical Freeze on the Wii U. That was nice. That's good. Oh, no. Those are really good, too. Yeah. Uh, I'm being told to up the game volume. I can oblige that. Sorry. Settings are a little off today. Uh, apparently, I also missed Mexican Waluigi getting an egg. Here you go, Mexican Waluigi. Thanks for subbing. You will give me an egg. Oh, that rule. Okay, I understand what they're talking about. Now I'm back in the loop. Did 
13 lives already. And they're gonna have that it much. is a Nintendo game. That's true. <laughs> Cranky's can't. Oh, man. Am I the no, I'm not at the swimming stage already. I hate the swimming stages in this game. That is one thing I will chastise, at least the original Donkey Kong Country 4, that the swimming stages were more or less useless. Aww. Um, what? What? <laughs> huh? Uh, wait, wait till you see me start this stage and then you see me throw a barrel. Just watch what happens after that. Okay. Because you've got the delay. Yeah. Uh, oh. Oh. Okay, that was weird. That, Pretty yeah. Sure. Pretty sure that was a real thing I was supposed to be able to pick up. <laughs> it's fake I am. <laughs> Whatever, we'll go with it at this point. Yeah. Okay, I need a refresher. I, I'm a couple stages away from it, so hopefully I'll see it in time. What is the jump I need to get on the minecart stage to immediately warp to the end of it? Is it literally the very first jump I have to fall in the pit? Because I never used to take the shortcut in that stage. And I just broke a barrel. Crap. Uh, did he? December 1st, 2013, Donkey Kong Country 1, last played on stream. So, December. Wow. What? Yeah. Why, why has it been sitting by my SNES for, like, nine months? <laughs> I've been waiting. I guess I clear out that spot pretty often, so I'm a little surprised. Soon I shall be played. <laughs> Soon. Someday I will be requested, and when that day comes, <laughs> I I won't work. <laughs> Strong Bobby thirteen, thanks for subbing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. Because of course the game didn't work right off the bat too, so I'm like, all right, give me a sec, I'll get this warmed up. Did you blow in it? Yes, I did. Even, okay, though, even though you're not supposed to. I know, but it's, it helps. It's been scientifically proven. Scientifically proven by 10-year-olds everywhere. Yep. Jump over the launch barrel in the beginning. Hey, man, 10-year-old me doesn't do anything wrong, right? The God knows 10-year-old me did a lot of things wrong. Yeah. I'm convinced at this point, like, every year version of me did something wrong. That the, that the current version will always be paying for. Like having a picture taken of them. Arizona1 just subscribed. Ooh, Arizona, thank you for subscribing. Here's your egg. Or resubscribing, rather. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. I think maybe I don't like the swimming stages because the music's too mellow. It feels like I'm about to fall asleep. <laughs> oh, there's danger everywhere. <laughs> Oh, there's fish trying to kill me. Right. <laughs> Video game. I don't I don't know what it is, man. Like even like the later Donkey Kong Country games get like more exciting underwater music. This is just super mellow. I already missed that one up. Big, Big D. Wow. Big D 6350. Thank you for resubbing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. The Big D. The Big D. The biggest of D's. <laughs> the biggest D. I mean, it's, it's measured by 6350, so... What, is that inches or what? <laughs> <laughs> Meters! <laughs> Meters! Oh, God! <laughs> it's a very serious problem. They shouldn't be laughing about it. <laughs> and his only comment is, it's a damn trouble getting pants. <laughs> <laughs> I would... I, probably a lot of things, not just pants. <laughs> Like, that's the only thing we think of. Eh, pants are probably an issue. Yeah. Never mind social graces. Hey, man, that's a that's a discussion topic. <laughs> Gi <laughs> gigantic dicks. The discussion topic. How many times have you heard the are you happy to see me joke? Dick punch the helicopter. Just subscribe. Oh, shit. There's an oldie. Dick punch the helicopter. Thanks for resubbing. Here's your egg. You will give me. I hope an you're egg. not punching the 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 the, the, the big D. <laughs> it's a dick helicopter now. <laughs> oh no! <laughs> That'd be terrifying. I know, like dick punch the helicopter. Oh, was that Saints Row or was that something else? I feel no. I feel like that was Saints Row, because Saints Row had a dedicated dick punch button, right? Uh, I. 
thing? Yeah, it's one of those. I'm pretty sure that was the running gag, because I remember trying to fight helicopters. And Omnimon206 just subscribed. Omnimon206, thanks for subbing, here's your egg. You will give me an egg. Wow, we're actually almost on World 1, too. Saints Row 3, apparently? Uh, and 4. Cause I yeah, I was pretty sure 4 did, too. Yeah, because Wesker was going around dick-punching people. That was a thing for quite a while. Ah, oh, crap. I missed a secret. Am I going to be able to get this? Nope. Well, once you go secret, you never go secret. Words, true words live by. Alright, I think I can possibly get it this time. Oh, wait, what? Oh, it's not this spot. Shit. <laughs> well, damn. Well, gosh diddly darn. Jiminy Jellickers. Oh, it was the it was that part. Shit. Uh, am I going to be able to do this? Probably not. Oh, I actually did. Kazuno Corona, thank you for subscribing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. I don't even need to look at this part. I love this one. Oh, yeah. I must have missed that one. Wow. Oh, there you go. Man, my eyes aren't what they used to be. <laughs> I know. Streaming can take a lot out of you, man. Can't can't <laughs> read words anymore. Busy talking about helicopters, dick punching, big Ds. Well, you know. I think that's uh, pretty standard, though, these days, you know? <laughs> Growing up is depressing. Don't ever grow up, John. We love you. We love your as you are. You're as you are. I know it's a typo. <laughs> Am I forgetting something? No, I think this is safe. Yep. Cool. Hey, I have had good news today. Ooh, what happened? I paid off the repairs of my 3DS, and I should get it back by the end of the week. Nice. Yeah. Be careful with your 3DS, peoples. The hinges are not what they used to be. Would you do it? I don't know, because one day I remember feeling like, man, this top screen's feeling a bit loose. And then a few months later, I'm like, I wonder why. And then I looked, and the hinge is starting to snap. And I was like, oh, that would do it. Yeah, my 3DS has been having some problems, too. It doesn't actually uh, always turn on when you open it. Oh. Who the fuck is... Hang on. Sorry, that's my apartment buzzer. We're the internet police. We've come to tell you to stop talking about big D's on stream. What? What did I miss? <laughs> Said people that come to your door. We're the internet police. We've told you to stop talking about big D's on stream. <laughs> the uh, that was the same person who, for the past like two or three days, keeps calling my uh, apartment, thinking it's someone else's apartment. God damn it! It's the same person too, because there's cameras on our uh, on our buzzer, so I can actually see who's at the door. Hi, Otsuki. Yes, I see it, Tenma. Well, what's up? He, he totally wants me to pick Freedom Planet if I get a choice in the matter. Oh, he yeah, Tenma has been been playing it lately, and he's been a little upset at it, for lack of a better term. <laughs> What 3DS games are you looking forward to, John? Um, the two sitting on my desk I haven't started yet. <laughs> what are they? Professor Layton versus Phoenix Wright and uh, Theatre Rhythm Curtain Call. <gasps> Ooh, both good picks. Other, I'm other just than that, looking forward to smash, 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 smash. Yeah, same here. <laughs> but I'm, I'm worried about like damaging my 3DS because I'm probably going to go like a little rough on it. I'm probably, I'm probably going to be um, careful. 
<laughs> I wouldn't want to get my 3DS back just to have to send it off again. <laughs> that would that would be kind of funny in a way, but it would also be really sad. That would. But apparently, like the pictures you've been seeing of people breaking their uh, their little analog nub, uh, that isn't actually like any plastic being broken. That's just the rubber coming off, apparently, and you could glue that back on. Well, so. what about those that I saw, like the little silver container at the bottom, or like the little silver nub? Because it looks like with some people, it's actually been flat out breaking. Oh dear, I didn't. I haven't seen those pictures. I've only been. They're, seeing they're not as frequent. Do you have an original 3DS or an XL? That's the original. Yeah, apparently, like that—that's it's been more on the originals than it has on the XLs. I can see that being the case. I don't know. I'm, I'm wary to upgrade to an XL because I like the the size of the original. But with the new models coming out, if, if it ever comes to North America, I might actually get it. Okay. So, XLs are so good. So they said jump over the first barrel. Probably not where I fell. All right, let's try that again. Straight down. Yes, straight down. Got it. Yee. No, they still have to deal with that one dickish enemy right at the end, of course. What if they come out with the 4DS? Whoa. <laughs> Dude, I would love a machine that could control time. That'd be great. <laughs> We've we've upgraded our 3DS with TARDIS technology. Dude, I'd be totally down for that. <laughs> I guess I'll ask you this since you brought it up. Have you seen the new season of Doctor Who? Like, I'm not following it. I'm still behind a season, so. Nah, I. There was at some point in just me watching TV shows where I just went, you know what? I can't be bothered. <laughs> Oh, fair Sorry. enough. I picked up Series 7. I still haven't watched that either, so. I've been hearing exactly the same thing. It's like it's like the Doctor cycle, though. The new one comes in, everyone's like, ooh, I don't know if I like this one, and then they grow on them. <laughs> Sorry. So it's like any TV show. Got it. Yeah. It's like, oh, I don't know. And then, you know, come back two months later. Oh, he's the best. Best one. Best one. <laughs> oh, shit, I broke that too early. Oh, see, the 4DS is complete with smell vision Oh, man. Was it Nintendo that actually, like, put in a patent for smell vision at some point? Because I know that was an actual thing. Really? Some, I, I, like I said, it might not have been Nintendo, but some company actually has, like, a copyright on the idea of smell vision and attempted it. Well, if that ever happens, remind me to never play a Wario game. <laughs> what if that's the game they actually... I could see that actually being the game they would put it on. Garlic and farts. Great. Yep. <laughs> Reminds me of an Italian family dinner. <laughs> Zero copy just subscribed. Zero copy. Thank you for resubbing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. Smell-o-vision with a zombie game. That'd be fun. Uh, okay, so there are definitely some things you would not want to smell. I'm not going <laughs> to deny that. Oop. Winky! I don't know why you'd call a frog Winky, but I'll go with it. Well, I'm not necessarily dissing the, the smell of garlic. It's just I imagine I'd, you'd get very bored of it very quickly. I think bored might not be the right word for that. <laughs> just a hunch. Now, I'm going to go back and get that secret I missed because I believe I can just jump out of the stage. Do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do-do. <laughs> Oh, there was even another bail there anyways. I did it, I failed. Congratulations. I did it. I murdered someone. 
Ah, good. Okay, that's been all, all the Donkey Kong games. Let's go to Stop and Go Station. And then not do the stage. Oh my god. No, th this game had a lot of a lot of weirdly hidden shortcuts, and like the only one I ever remembered was the one in Stop and Go Station, which was literally just walk to the left. Donut. Oh god, that went too fast. Donut seventy seven just subscribed. Donut seventy seven. Thank you for subbing. Here's your egg. You will give me an egg. Oh, I guess I should actually do that stage for the actual secrets. It's the only downside. There's like one of the few stages that had a secret exit, but you actually still needed to go through it for the secrets. Yeah. So you've never played a single Donkey Kong Country game at all? Like, I, I can get why if you were said you were a Genesis kid, but... Uh, of the No, I, I have played a bit of the original, uh, but my, my first real interaction with the original was... Um, so we decided to, hey, let's try net playing it. <laughs> oh, man. So, so that was a fun thing, especially when we got to the minecart level. Then I gave up and never looked back. <laughs> I don't blame you on that one. Oof. Uh, but uh, no, I have, I, I think I, I don't know, I, I've tried one of them at some point, but I don't remember which one or when. It might have been a long time ago. But the only one I've actually, like, proper played is uh, Tropical Freeze, but... Oh, like I said, I think they're all right games, but I can I can really only safely recommend the second one. Maybe the maybe the third too. I think the order of quality is two, three, one, best or worst. Hmm. Okay, I'll try out the second one at some point then. Because I, I mean, the first one was where they just kind of established all the rules, and like it's a little rough around the edges. The result. Second one seems like they got their stuff together and just made like a fantastic game. And the third one they got experimental, which works and doesn't work depending on how you feel about some of the gimmicks they put in the game that sounds like most series doesn't it it's like Mega Man 1 gave you the base idea a bit rough around the edges Mega Man 2 really good I don't know I I like 3 more than 2 if we're talking Mega Man yeah um, but I think that's because Mega Man 3 has like almost double the content as a result yeah I mean Mega Man had a lot of numbers to uh to improve on. Wow, someone says one's way better than three. I don't know if I go that far. Oh, a lot of people actually say three's the worst. I don't know. It's back and forth. I see some people agreeing with me and some people saying they prefer uh, one over three. But it does seem to be like consensus that two was the best of the three Donkey Kong Country games. Wait, how long have we been playing? Jump back in there. 16. Wow, holy crap. I'm, I think the top file was actually the last time we streamed it. It says 24 minutes and we got 18%. We're at 16 right now with 22%. And, oh. I, and I already missed the secret back in World 1. And I didn't bother going back to get it. And I went back to get a couple others too. Oh, I think I also because we didn't skip Minecart Mayhem last time. So that might also be why. That would make sense. Wow. So I got a gex has yet to play a Mega Man game. What I, is it even? Uh, you know what? You'd be surprised how many people have that kind of status. Mind you, my friend got really like surprised when I said, Oh yeah, no, I've never played Doom. I didn't play Doom until like college. But I also wasn't allowed to play Diablo growing up because Satan. Oh, okay. Which is funny because that exact same weekend I bought Perfect Dark, which was an M-rated game. <laughs> Do I own any of the Tingle spin-offs? I have the first one. Uh, I don't think the second one actually even has an English translation officially. Because I know that Rupee Land actually did at least make it over to UK. It, yeah, it did. I remember seeing that in stores and going, why? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't even know they made a second one. Yeah. I think it's, like, completely different, too. Like, you get transformed into Tingle instead or something like that. And yet the question still remains. Why? <laughs> <laughs> what do you, you mean you don't want to live as Tingle? You don't want to live vicariously through him? You know, I'd say yes is a joke, but I can't even go that far. <laughs> Here, right? Mm -hmm. 
Now here, this brings up the question: What happens if they make a like actual Legend of Zelda style game where you play as Tingle, like sword, sword fighting, and everything? But I'd you're you're it. just but you're just Tingle. I do. As long right. as there's no voice clips. You don't want Kulin Power or whatever he says all the time being said. Yeah. No, there's there's, there's the gimmick. He says it every time he swings a sword. Every time. <laughs> It's just like at three times the length of going, what? That? <laughs> you need, what we need is a uh, Tingle DLC Viral Warriors. You know, uh, there's rumors. There, oh, no. There's rumors. Nah, no. No, I was kidding. Please stop. I, no, I don't think it'll actually be the case though, but that would be funny if it was. Oh, God. Uh, is there a schedule for you uploading live stream videos on your YouTube account? Uh... They're supposed to be, but the events of this week have thrown it off, so it's unfortunately behind schedule as a result. I'm probably just going to upload like a couple of streams tonight or tomorrow then as a result to make up for it. Groose let him loose. Tingle for Mario Kart DLC. You see, that I could believe. I could believe that happening. Groose of all people? Or, oh, him being uh, in Mario Kart. Uh, single. Uh, oh my god. Did I miss a secret? No, 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 no. Jesus. No, that's weird, I didn't. Alright, what's up? It's a, it's a picture of a tweet of someone's reaction to the to Smash, I guess. And they literally snapped the car in half, and their 3DS, I don't even... Oh, that can't. picture! I saw Jake retweeting that the other day. You can't describe what that looks like. <laughs> Jesus. Smash is apparently very serious business. Oh man, I could tell you stories about like the Smash scene in Calgary because uh, there's this one guy. He used to like help run a lot of the events in the area, but he had anger issues. Like holy oh. crap. I